Mike. Mike. Let's make a video. You ready to make a video? Good boy. All right, hey, uh, this is Rocky's Roads. I'm gonna make an instructional video for y'all. Kind of rough doing this walker. We're gonna show you how to do performance improvements on your motorcycle. And last but not least, this is for instructional purposes. Oh man, it's hard without using that walker, being at my old age. Man, lordy. First thing we're gonna teach you about, performance exhaust. Some of you people say, oh, I gotta have a nice carbon fiber can and all this free flowing exhaust. No, you don't. Cut your mufflers off, cut the cat off and put these shorties on it. That gives extra power, lots of noise. You don't need to have all this high dollar crap that, that costs extra money, that makes it sound different. All you need is these shorties. That or go to your hardware store and get a piece of uh, flexible pipe. Some of the pipe you can use would be EMT, electrical, that flexible crap. Just cut your cut your your stuff off down there and and, and put a put a tie wrap metal metal strap and make it loud. It makes it go faster. Next, we have fairing remover removal tool. Look at this. This is all you need for to take fairings off. You don't need all these fancy things to take these fasteners and those little plastic things up front. Real technicians use fairing remover tool like this. Next, chain cleaner. This is all you need. This stuff will clean anything. A lot of people say you need to have oh special kerosene or some high dollar shit in a spray can to protect your O-rings. Who needs O-rings? Use this stuff. It's great. Oil. Racing oil. A lot of people, they say, oh man, I got to put Motul or, or full synthetic. No, you don't. Get this stuff right here. It's basically the same thing because it's cheap. It's real cheap, and it's uh, recycled using the premium uh, filters. Yeah, use, use motor oil. It's great, and this is where your oil goes right here. Next, for you stunners, you want to take and change. Let me get around on the other side. Oh, I can do it without the walker. I know I can't. Oh, 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 it's, it's a bitch being old. See, a lot of these bikes come with these, with these little sprockets. You can't do wheelies right. So what you want to do, let me see if I can get this thing up. You need to get a good sprocket. The, the kind that makes you do killer wheelies like this. This is a wheelie sprocket. Of course, you got to turn it like this since you're going forward and the chain pulls that way. This is a wheelie sprocket. If you want a real wheelie sprocket, get this kind. See, it says it's got closer teeth than this one. That makes you have more power for wheelies. Oh, uh, next. You see a lot of these bikes, they've got LEDs on them. They put them all under the fairings and stuff. No, if you want to be really rad and be like a, go real fast, put red LED hog lights on your bike. That way you can mount it like right here. Bitches love LEDs, especially red ones. So you put these red LEDs, you can mount them anywhere, see? It's hog lights, they're red LEDs. Next, when you're racing, you wanna tell people, well, these nuts. So what you do is you super glue or hot glue these nuts all over your bike. That way they know you're badass and your bike goes fast. So that's my tricks for you. Oh, let me get my walker. Come on, Mike. Stay out of them pecans. Let me get my walker. Oh. oh. So that's my tips for the day of how to make your bike badass. It'll go fast with the custom sprockets with the real close teeth. That way you can put a, a, a cheaper chain on there like bicycle chain and stuff like that because it'll have to grip the teeth. And since it's such a big sprocket, you'll have more power for those badass radical wheelies you wanna to do to impress the bitches. That, shorty pipes, uh, brake cleaner, chain cleaner, <laughs> cheap recycled oil, and don't forget your fairing removal tool. All right, man, 
I hope this teaches y'all something. And uh, instead of my usual post with a bunch of pictures and shit, this is a good how to do it uh, video. So y'all ride fast, keep two wheels down on the ground, uh, don't run from cops, and don't speed. Don't ever speed. That way you won't have to worry about the cops coming after you. All right, later.